Hello everybody and welcome back to another game of Popper. We are playing some Rakdos Control and well we got two lands, we got double Knight's Whisper, we got some removal, duress. Yeah. Seems good. Opponents on a mulligan, which is always good for us. They're on the play. Swamp, pass it. I like the I like their swamp. Uh should I go with duress on turn? Mmm, I don't think I'm going to need to use Firebolt on turn 2, so I can probably go with Bloodfell Chaos on turn 2, or I could alternatively go with Bloodfell Chaos, maybe go for Knight's Whisper. There's no rush for the Duress if they're playing, like, Black Control. Yeah, let's just go with the Bloodfell Caves, and uh, that gives us more options for, like, Liliana Spectre or Knight's Whisper, or, well, it basically opens up our, our whole hand for the next three turns a lot more easily. Edict. Okay. So, uh, in that case, I'm just going to go ahead and duress our opponent. See what they've got. Chainers, Edict, Geth's Verdict, Pestilence, Read the Bones. So they can remove all of our stuff all the time, forever. Do I care about Pestilence? No. I'm going to take Read the Bones. And uh, we are going to pass. We're going to get a nice two for one out of the Liliana Spectre, that's for sure. So this is where they would have cast the Read the Bones, but we are one step ahead. And I'm just going to go ahead and run out the Spectre. It'll be a nice two for one, very easy. And we'll have six. Yep, all those life. You discard. Chainers, maybe? They discard their pestilence. Good. Opponent passes. Very nice. Uh, let's see if we can hit our land drops. Nice. Double land. Nice whisper. Nice whisper. Thorn's gonna win us the game. And there's the Evancars. Perfect. So let's go for Radiant Fountain. One, two, three, four. Thorn of the Black Rose. That duress was super, super key, I think. Getting rid of the read the bones. Ugh. I don't even want him getting life. One, two, three, four, five. Getting pretty close to uh, Evan Carr's Justice. Hopefully, you don't have any main deck. Um, discard. That would be a shame. Okay, let's go for the Swamp. Castle Buyback. Pass the turn. Discarding, uh, let's discard the Thorn of the Black Rose. Opponent, it's just passing. Okay, so same deal. Buying back our Evancar's Justice, and then we're going to go for the Carnarium. Picking up Radiant Fountain. And we're going to pass the turn and discard two cards. We're going to discard Mountain and Terminate. There's Thorn. Let's 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So let's edict them. Cast Arvin Cars Justice, we'll buy back, pass the turn. They are now the monarch, though. Don't remember discarding that thorn, but I guess I did. Sign and blood down to ten. Uh, we're going to discard Carnarium. That's... <laughs> I'm surprised they're playing that. <laughs> that's kind of a funny one. What did I get? Pristine Talisman. Oh, that's too bad. All right, Raven's Crime. Not going to do much at this point. Uh, let's see. I've got two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we're getting pretty close. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. buyback. Uh, then we can Carnarium, pick up the Radiant Fountain, and pass the turn. We're at nine. We've got seven points of burn here. They're going to need to gain some life here if they want to do something. Consume spirit. Okay, so they're not dead. Because I could have having cars justice for just for four here. Gotta be careful for these though. Oh, that's really good. Okay, so let's gain. One, two, three. Talisman. Four, five, six, seven. Evan cars turn. Another thorn. Okay. It's not going to help them at this point. Wouldn't mind drawing some more burn. Angler's good. Um, uh, hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's cast this with buyback. One, two, three, four, five. And then I guess we can. I can either lightning bolt the thorn. But, yeah, I should probably do that, because in case they have another Tendrils of Corruption, I don't want them gaining life off of that. I want to keep the board clear. And I guess we can cast this Raven's Crime here. Probably should have done that before the bog. There's the file. Very good card. Opponent passes. Okay. Second terminate. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Evan Carr. And uh, one, two, three, four, five. Let's firebolt their face. Pass the turn. Now, the only thing that could really get us would be, like, corrupt at this point. To be really careful about that. Hmm. 
Uh, so we should probably bolt first, eh? Bolt now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, we got there. Whew. Relic. Hmm. Grim Harvest. That's pretty much it, right? Don't really want to board it anything else. Didn't see any artifacts for the Gorilla Shaman. Like they're not running their own pristine talismans. Definitely going to cut at least one Terminate, maybe both. But then I'm, I'm afraid of Gurmok Anglers. So maybe just three is fine, and we can take out, like, one Firebolt, I guess. Or maybe just the Raven's Crime. We're not really looking to board in Choking Sands. We can't kind of get them off their, their mana, per se. Yeah, getting that Read the Bones at the beginning was really important. Okay, let's try it like that. Just very light sideboarding. We got enough advantage out of the Thorn to kind of get us through that game. There's the Grim Harvest. Kind of susceptible to duress here, but... Don't think we can ship this hand back. Ooh, that's really good. Okay, so let's go for the Radiant Fountain. Uh, I guess I should go for the Carnarium, shouldn't I? Or, yeah, let's go with the Carnarium. What do we discard? Maybe just a, a land? No. Grim Harvest, I guess? It's a little annoying. Maybe that's what's going to have to be, though. Or I could go for Bajuka Bog. Next turn, play Pristine Talisman. Then the turn after that. But that's that's quite a while without going for a red mana, though. Do we really need it right now? I guess not. Let's go for the Bajuka Bog. Slow roll it. Let's get greedy. Opponent's uh, almost two minutes ahead of us. We do need to be careful about that. Uh, and Pristine Talisman early is really going to help us out. So now we pick up our Radiant Fountain. We've got another bog here, so I'm not too uh, concerned about that. We do want to make sure that we're <laughs> somewhat competitive on time, because this might be a really long match. Though we did a lot more than our opponent did in the previous match. He, he passed his turns very, very quickly. Uh, so let's replay our Radiant Fountain. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pass the turn. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I can play my Grimog Angler, but I can't Grim Harvest it in the same turn. I think we'll pass again. Because for sure our opponent has like just tons and tons of removal.
I once had a person tell me that I had ugly swamps because I was playing this. This is what a swamp actually looks like. <laughs> oh, they are running the talisman. Darn. I should have figured with the pestilence, but I didn't see it. They saw, like, almost half their deck. Read the bones. Okay. What'd they do? One card on top, one card on bottom. No! It takes a lightning bolt. There's the swamp. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ang. Oh! Angler. I mean, he, he, of course, has removal for this, but... Tendrils? Ugh. Do I terminate my own angler? Do I care that they gain 9 life here and then go up to 10? They're going to go up to 27. Okay. Alright. I mean, this is it's a 5-5. Five five. It's a big boy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So seven, eight, nine. Ah, oh, I should have played my Bajuka Bog last turn, I guess. Hmm. I guess we'll get rid of Terminate. Terminate and Bolt, I guess. That actually helps me out a little bit, because that means I can play for, pay for Gurmag using these spells. Knight's Whisper helps, too. So let's Gurmag. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's bog. I'm at 31, my goodness. Early Talisman. Though, plus the Radiant Fountain. Double Radiant Fountain. We've gained a lot of life. Staying on par with our opponent here. not like to see wrench mind again that would not be fun whoa <laughs> consume spirit on me okay wow hmm one two five six seven eight nine ten mana I can pay for this Grimlock Angler and leave up Grim Harvest. Okay. Right, we're a minute behind now. We're slowly catching up. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Being very careful to leave up three for Grim. I, I could imagine they have double removal spell for these anglers. Ugh. Okay, that's annoying, though. Uh, 
Yep. So they lose their pestilence. They got rid of both my anglers. Blood found a good draw. Let's grim harvest the angler. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, in that case, let's knight's whisper. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we'll pass the turn. Ooh, is it going to be another consume? It is for nine this time. Down to nine. Oh my goodness. This is like big burn black. Huh. Okay, well, let's Gurmog. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. They just need one more big burn spell, really. get it for eight. This pristine talisman has been super important. So we're going to pay for it. Get it back. Down to two. <laughs> and three. Okay, so up to three. Four, five, okay. All right, one more. Do you have the answer? Do you have another burn spell? Looks like they do. Ugh. <laughs> wow, this deck is, is quite something. Oh my goodness. I feel like they probably got a little lucky getting their three consumed spirits. Huh. Well. Oh, this is non-swamp anyway. It doesn't do anything. Uh, so they're really like not on the Gurmog plan. Let's bring in let's bring in one of these guys. Let's take out um Let's take out a chainers. And um, let's take out all the chainers. Don't think that'll be very good. And maybe like one terminate. So we can pay seven mana to kill a, uh, <laughs> a talisman. That's insane, but uh, that's where we're at. Okay, we're on the play. No red mana, but we do have Talisman on turn three, so I guess we'll keep. These games go long anyway, so chances are I'll fix myself. Wrench Mine might be uh, pitching Pristine Talisman, but we'll see. Maybe I'd prefer to pitch the Gurmog Angler, or maybe the removal. Opponent takes a mulligan, keeps. Puts it on top again. Okay, let's go for the bog. Save targets, always yield. Ooh, thorns a good draw. Let's go with the fountain. Fifty seconds behind.
Gorilla Shaman. All right. Talisman. Next turn we get Thorn. They get something inconsequential. Well, I guess Lightning Bolt's always nice, but uh, let's go for the Thorn here. Evan cars. Okay. So we're up quite a bit of uh, life. They may not have kept... Oh, there's the tendrils. Darn! <laughs> I was going to say, I don't think they kept that much removal. But... Okay, let's go for Night's Whisper. Ooh. Okay. Bloodfell. That was a zero life investment, which is always nice. Duress. Let's grab the tendrils and pass. Getting another swamp. We found a red mana. Opponents played their swamp and is passing. Another fountain. Sure. <sighs> I guess we can. Uh, Talisman. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Make them use their edict. They need to have something to do. Carnarium. Okay, it's going to give us some more life, or I can also Bajuka Bog and get rid of the edict that they're going to use. No, I'm going to hold on to this thorn. Uh, I think the play... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's go for the Evancar's Justice. Rakto's Carnarium. Pick up the fountain. Pass the turn. Sign of Blood. Read the bones. Lose some more life. Okay. Gorilla Shaman. Let's go for the fountain. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Buyback. Night's Whisper. Bolt. Okay. Let's discard some stuff. Uh, we're going to discard this Swamp and this uh, Gorilla Shaman. Another Read the Bones, down to 12. Are we going to get away with this game? Ha! You were holding on to it, probably. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, we just drew another one, too. Okay, so. This is going to pay dividends in the long run, you'll see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah. And uh, we'll just play this mountain, I guess, and uh, pass the turn. Draw a card. All right. I prefer that over Tendrils of Corruption. We get our third Pristine Talisman, which is awesome. Yeah, they're going to have a really hard time killing us. They do have Corrupt. There you go. Back up to 21. I'm going to call this deck Big, Big Burn Black.
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's the Grim Harvest. Let's get the Gurmog. Play our land. Let's Justice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then Crypt Rats. Yep. For six. Uh, gonna get rid of this thorn. Six, seven. I think that's good. Yep, that's fine. Okay. Ooh, there's another bog. That'll be good if they don't feel like using their edict now. Triple talisman. It's going to be really hard for them to win. Okay, they're just going to use it now. That's fine. Sack this. Pay for it. Get it back. We have so much mana. <laughs> oh, okay. So we've got a lot of burn now. Seven points, eight, nine. Okay, so let's do this. Three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I guess we bog them. And uh, let's pass. Get rid of Terminate and Thorn. I have access to it with Grim Harvest here, so I'm not too worried about it. Not that I think giving them the monarchy at this point would not be the worst thing. Ugh, they just won't die. Let's get back the Angler. Uh, so I think we should play the Bloodfell Caves, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're at thirteen. Do I want to go to eleven? Let's just play the Gurmog Angler. Yeah, I could I could play uh, something else, but I think I want to stay ahead on life for now. <laughs> Ugh. Some discard would be really, really good right now. I wonder where it is. I didn't take any out, did I? I think I put it back in. Yeah, it's all in. Maybe I should play these Gorilla Shamans. Could have Grim Harvested. Oh well. Okay, so I guess we Grim Harvest. Let's get back the Angler. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven. Oops. Okay, I guess I need black mana. There you go. It's Carnarium. <laughs> I am not playing this efficiently, but uh, okay. There you go. Gorilla Shaman. No! <laughs> well, this is bizarre. There we go. Okay. <laughs> I have no idea why that uh, worked out that way. Jeez, lost a lot of time there. Okay. Uh, do... I do the do. Do I Grim Harvest? No, I don't. I'm gonna play this... Uh... I'm gonna Lightning Bolt. <laughs> I mean, Fire Bolt. We're gonna lose our mana. Ah! I used 30 seconds, just like that? Okay, another Fire Bolt. They're down. They're down to 11. Please. Please just die. No. Ah! <laughs> Where's my discard? Where, where is it? Oh. Okay, let's gain a life. Let's duress. Come on. Gets verdict, okay. Uh, let's, um... Grim Harvest, Grimog Angler. One, two, three, four, five. Six and seven. They're down to zero cards in hand. Uh, pfft. I mean, I'm going to play this Gorilla Shaman just in case, but. Bring them back down to 20. Man, their life has been yo-yoing up and down. And now they're at the mercy of their top deck. Lightning Bolt. Ah, oh, they got their thorn. Okay. That's really bad for us, actually. So now I just got rid of mine. Ugh. Okay, uh, we can get them in. Get them in for seven. Oh, we get the. That's right. We get the monarchy back. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> that usually never happens. Uh, and uh, one, two, three, four. four. Five. Let's just firebolt their face. Firebolt their face. Firebolt their face. Carnarium. Grab the fountain. Pass the turn. There's a relic. Okay. Sign and blood. Two. I mean, we're dead to a corrupt. <gasps> uh, is that enough? Oh, it's not quite enough. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Arg. Um. Seven, eight, nine. Can't kill them yet. Let's relic. Let's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <sighs> okay, it's all on this top deck. 
Oh, Raven's Crime. Land? No. Oh! Oh my goodness! I can't believe it. <laughs> oh my god! We got so close! Oh, what would we have drawn? Duress. There is all of our discard. Oh man, what a disappointing match, but what a great match. I hope you guys enjoyed that, and uh, we will, we'll see you next time.